Hi, this is Jay from Encodian. We've created this short video um, to run through how you can remove or flatten PDF annotations uh, within a PDF document. We've had quite, uh, or we've had several queries relating to this over the past few months, and um, whilst we have an action that covers this, it's not particularly obvious. So, um, within the compressed PDF action, so this is the article of our support portal, you'll see. Um, you can pass a file in, but also we've got several advanced options, and these advanced options are what allow us to can either flatten or delete annotations, which I've got highlighted here. There are some other options as well, such as compressing the images contained in the document, removing objects, and form field flattening as well. But the two that we're interested in for this particular purpose are flattening annotations and deleting annotations. So let's take a look at a PDF document for our test or our demo. We've got a couple of a comment. Um, some text replacement, some highlighting in a stamp, uh, and you can see that those are all active on the right-hand panel here. So the first uh, test we're going to do is, is, is to run this document through, and we're going to flatten it. So let me just jump over to the flow. Nice and simple, manual file being selected. I'm going to run it through the compress action. Uh, I've left all the default settings on, and I've got it to flatten. It's by default it's going to flatten and it won't remove. Um, and I'm then going to save that as a file called flatten.pdf and I'm just going to add that to OneDrive for test purposes. So let's just manually select my file. And there we go. And we'll just run that, we'll run that through and we'll get that, hopefully get that file created quite quickly onto OneDrive. Okay, so that file's been received onto OneDrive. I'm just going to double click and open that up. So here's the flatten.pdf that's just been, been created. I'll just drag that over. There's flatten.pdf. So you can see straight away the differences. So these, um, these are now actually flattened onto the document. They're not selectable. They've actually they've been left onto the document but have been flattened into the PDF itself, So which is why we can't see that right-hand bar. Now, if I wanted to remove those annotations, it's a very simple change onto the flow. What we're going to do is so I'm going to go back onto the action, I'm going to click delete annotations and just remove the flattening and I'm going to call this uh, delete and then we'll run that through again but we, this time what we'll do is we'll pass in um, using the automatic test there because it's going to use the last data that I passed in for the trigger which is the document I previously selected and that's going to run through for me again and hopefully that file will get created fairly quickly. Right, okay, so that file's just been created, delete.pdf. I'll double click and open that up. And you can see now those annotations that were present on the document have been completely removed from the document. So we've got all of the annotations present and active. We've got them flattened where they are present, but in essence, they've just been burnt into the document. And then we've got the actual removal of those annotations as well. So hopefully that shows you exactly how you can either flatten or delete annotations using the Encodian compressed PDF uh, action, uh, part of the Flow R connector for Power Automate. Um, if you have any further questions or support queries, you can email support at encodian.com uh, or of course visit our support portal.